the barbarians, which we probably are. No, all of them can actually wipe us out in it easily. Ever in service. One turn there. Their navy ran away as well. Put your backs into it, you men. Get on watch. You for tax rate. We're gonna need more money. See what can we get here. Oh, this army is pretty well off. We don't need to beef this one up a little bit. I don't know. These are still decent. Sets of cab on both. Would you like you more, but we can uh, use that. Our advantage, two is enough. That actually, the game actually told me, like, uh, are these good? Are these bad? What, what, like, what tier troops are they? Just can't tell. I live to serve Rome. Right, we can get champions as well now. Let's grab two of them. Replenishment. I am Rome's champion. Okay, we're gonna grab the other one next turn. At all, more or less. Looks like they want to attack us again at the same place. And the same fate will befall them. I think I can get my armies down there yet. Talk to the wise woman. Sure. All right, let's move him. What the hell are you doing there? On the road again. Let's move over there so we don't piss off. Piss off the. Action over there. At once. Ready for orders. My wits and my sword is yours. Stand ready for men. battle. No, oh, that's bullshit. Why can't you move him after that? Jesus Christ.
They might be able to get there next turn, so let's place them inside. Call this a garrison. Yeah, we're out the money. With infantry, slingers, levs. should be able to beat them there again. They only have two sets of like heavy hoplites there. And their king's on a horse, so that means he's just gonna charge in and get himself killed. that much money off of them. Search, we got that. Let's actually go with loyalty to political party. We never know when we're gonna have a civil war. We are fine for now. That's your command. You know, the recruitment is like uh, minus 10% of the unit recruitment costs is going to be real good in Rome. Okay, so they're gonna attack next turn. Now even if they take it next turn, we're gonna have an army to back to take it right back off of them. We should be fine. Research complete, good. Siege. Let's see what can we get here. And twenty five percent ammunition for units during siege battles. That's actually pretty good. 
Enable settlement gates to pour boiling oil. Uh, that's only gonna work for capitals. Upkeep cost for units higher. And that's pretty bad at this point. Mm, let's go with that. Actually, net. Let's not do that. Actually, a lot of attackers there. Ready for orders. Gonna be an issue. your ass down here oh my god takes him for fucking ever what can we recruit here levies levy well roari level levies same shit and skirmishers i think i recruit some troops in rome how can i be Ready, willing, and able. Okay, well, we can just check the garrison here. Well, it Italian town garden replenish. Yeah, we should still be fine, I think. We'll see. We are not warm up yet? Nope. Greetings. What about you guys? Nope. We need to switch this over to them. Or down. No, 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 mind. It's not that one. And there we go. Six turns. Everything takes for fucking ever in this game. In this mod. Ooh. Balance and power is not in our favor this time. See if I can score another win. I think their morale is going to break a lot faster this time around since uh, their general, general is probably going to run into our pikemen. This time we do know that they're going to go the one way over here. Hopefully. So let's stack all three of them there. Maybe, maybe it's a better idea to like let them... Uh, let's not... Let's do the exact same thing as last time. I don't know if they're going to do something different. Let's place the one with more the ones with more HP there. Spears. Spearmen, ready for orders. And them here. Romans, ready for duty. Melee troops awaiting orders. Missiles awaiting targets. Yours to command. Romans, ready for duty, ready for orders. 
second we're gonna move these that's actually let's leave them leave two here and flank with the two as well use the plebs the same way like last time just to hold down the enemy a little bit Could just block this area off. Not so sure that's a good idea. Though. Yeah, actually I wanted to do that, so let's actually try it. Spears! By your command. Orders? Your orders. Because we have deployables, might as well just use them. Somehow. Somewhere. Okay, so that line, that line ain't gonna move. Some of the PDA units progress, pre presenting an easy target for missile troops. Eh, no, nah. I would wonder if I place spikes there, or the enemy is gonna actually charge. Now, let's see what happens. Could go really freaking bad as well, but we got to save. I don't think we can actually ignite these, or so let's not place them at all. Okay, let's see. Cav charging in. Right through the f Damn, the AI is fucking stupid. Uh-oh. Uh oh, the, okay, this is a problem. You plebs stay there. We're gonna need you guys. Stay here as well. Okay, it's Hannibal himself. Let's see what if what the fuck he does. Is he that stupid? Seems like it. No, not you, plebs. You go over there. It looks like Hannibal is still dumb as fuck in the game. Okay, one of you go through here. The rest will flank all the way. this side though we're gonna we're gonna use one of them to flank all the way one from the side this one ain't this one here ain't gonna hold problem let's get one of them here Son 
Kings of Mars! Italian swordsmen! Jupiter gives us strength! Italian swordsmen! One of our units has used all its ammunition. I don't think our cab can actually catch up to their cab. Guys, rallied. General. Italian spearman. I think most of those guys are gonna die to friendly fire at this point. Early in the Punic Wars. This one was easier than the last one. Even though the game said that we we're gonna lo lose this one no matter what. Well, nah, not no matter what, but like it was a uh, balance of power was not in our favor, unlike the last one. You guys stop firing. Look at this marsh fucking pet. Tell 
Whoa, whoa. Go this way. What the? Jesus. That's most of them. Yeah! It's like 200 of them left. Most of them care, I, I'm probably gonna assume, since we can't catch up with them. That's how it's done. Then again, uh, well, I mean, you can increase the difficulty, but AI it still does the same tactics. It still has the same tactics and strategy. So it doesn't really change much, except the fact they have cheats. And so much for Hannibal. Beaten two of their armies? In theory. We wiped up all wiped out all their elite units. If the AI still plays by the same rules as us, we'll see if they do. Oh Jesus, fuck games. Why would I care about pirates down there? We <laughs> and you get to kill another general as well like that. Yeah, let's see. Campaign movement range, sure. We'll go for rank, Vanguard Legion. We we'll get more melee defense. Set up the watch. Ready for battle. At once. Yeah, it's gonna take a while till we get to down there. A long ass time. Good go by sea, but their navy is probably gonna wreck us, so let's not do that. Let's plant them right in the middle there. Now, as for here, I do want to go with Minerva for the research rate. These uh, let's let's just check. That is impossible. Yeah, we should be in the clear to disband them. Three K instantly, nice. What to do with the ship or three K freed up. Oh, 
We are going to take, need to take Syracuse still. So let's break the trade agreement with them. I will listen carefully to your work. A lack of your good. I can't trust him to not backstab me. Like the worst time possible. It's gonna take a quite a few turns to get down there. Glass Trader or Glass Factory? I think we're gonna go always. We're gonna always gonna go for like more trade goods. That's usually the better idea. Since we are trading with a lot of people. Be welcome, but may a thief. Your proposal has. Let's send these guys to Seleucids again. See if we can warm them, warm them up a little bit. And let's see. Massalia. Where is it? There it is. They're starting to hate us. We're gonna get wrecked by these barbarians here seems yeah definitely looks like it might be a good time to attack them but we do need to do it. cancel the trade with them first yeah we can see how many people they have there good get a couple more ships let's do that next turn though because like the last time i took syracuse two armies Carthaginian armies appeared and one navy at syracuse so that was fun i lost it immediately A treaty between us would please the god. Come on, no. I guess they technically, when they tr raid that, they raid our trade routes as well. My people can know. Middle tell you alliance. Nope. Yeah. <laughs> Your diplomat has been wounded and had had to return empty handed. No wonder. Look at that, they actually get Greek archers, Greek militia, Greek cavalry, Greek hoplites. Ooh. Garrison over there is pretty good. What do we get? Italian swordsmen, Italian so uh, town guard, citizens, and slingers. Yeah. I live to serve Rome. Swift and silent. Your 
Advance! At ease, men. Commander. March! I see, I didn't look at the champions yet. Missile attack range. Let's see, let's see. What about this line here? I think we want to gear for that. Additional losses when besieging and under siege, parent army, that might be good. Let's see here. Melee attack for command commander's unit, yeah, that's more or less useless. that yet let's stack the tax this one more as well now how long would it take okay two turns Let's grab a couple more guys here as well. We need good, strong men. Thanks for the follow, KCB. I think that's all we can do. Right, we can sell, send these guys on missions again. Get wounded, wounded as such. Okay, this why this guy had more luck. So let's get, send him to Massalia, even though there might not might not exist next turn, which is gonna be a little bit unfortunate. Right, he's wounded. Let's send him to the Seleucids. Well, I'm not finding it that hard, since the, well, I know why, because the AI runs into you like a more, like they send whole, the whole army to one point on the battlefield, then you just flank them, especially in villages, like I, I hired a couple of mercenaries here, like three of each of these, and was able to hold that against one stack of uh, Carthaginian troops, then another stack with Hannibal in it and kill them off, easy peasy. It really depends. You do quant. You do need to have a, like more troops than the enemy. That's for sure. That's the one thing you need to do. Otherwise, we did have some luck here. So Syracuse was taken over by Carthage, so that made things a little bit more interesting. I could have. I went up here to take this out. Hmm. Cancel that actually. At once. Could actually jump at them once they take this out. At your command. We'll see. Anyways. I wonder how, how, how many turns it's going to take for Carthage to come back. Apparently two.
Maybe they should check the diplomacy again. We might have more trade agreements to sign with someone. Damn these pirates. Why don't they come to Italian shore so we can actually kill them off? Well, I like how the AI just doesn't give a fuck about pirates at all. You just ignore them. Do you have to do it? Look, bands have offered their services to, imme immediate the op to intimidate the opposition. Views. Are they dead yet? They are. I am here to listen if you speak. Hmm. You honor us. There is right, I got an aggression pact with well let's deal let's deal with cartridge first. That's that's a bigger threat than I'm gonna fuck around up there. Okay, this is a navy. Ready for battle. At once. An ambush. I know the ambush ain't gonna work, but let's just try it anyway, you never know. Right, research. Go for the next tier of units. See what we get. I'm gonna need you to move down here. Since we are gonna take Syracuse next turn. Unless uh, they bring a lot more shit this way. And let's keep him there. I do know they have a fleet somewhere around here, or they had. Oh, it's gonna take them forever to get down there. But we could switch them out, like take Syracuse. Bring these guys back so they replenish a little bit. Let me just check everything. Are the military war- No, they're not done yet. Minus 10. Yeah, slaves might be an issue. At this point. As you command. I will see it. Ah shit. Wouldn't have done that. Don't have done that. Greetings. Okay, I always like wanna use uh, Sally is up there apparently. I always like wanna use uh, agents. The fucking chances are so freaking low. It doesn't, it doesn't seem worth it. Your proposal Try has agreement with tried. them. Why did not? Did you, you warm up? Attention. No, not yet. They are losing strength though. Seven Greek militia. Jeez. Might actually besiege this for a couple of turns. Maybe. We'll see. It is an honor to serve Rome. Since we have the money, why not recruit a little bit more of these? I don't think getting the levels is going to help us out because. Uh, we will have fire attacks. Just send them off to see if they might they might die. That's gonna work out well for us. Lower the taxes.
it's gonna be hard if you uh, i think well you can't expand like if you're used to playing room two you can expand really fast here you have to wait till you replenish troops and take it really slow i think that's why most people get fucked you know get screwed over by the ai at some point because you expand you can't replenish for whatever reason and your troops die off, get attacked at half strength and all that. It doesn't really leave room for errors as much as other games. Or like Vanilla Total War do. I do still wish that you had like retrained troops, like in Total War 1. Realm 1, that is. Politician ready to command. Oh, look at that. Our armies are gonna march further. Spend some money. You got, got enough. At your command. So what did we actually get? From like researching this. We hunger for battle. Maybe I should check here. I think the only oh the only thing that got upgraded was the bag train. I think I read that somewhere. No 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 not that. So upkeep costs that could actually be pretty good for us. We have some old shit units. Let's research this, see what happens as well. I kind of don't want to go in there until we get the agent back. I'm gonna get jumped by a whole lot of enemies. What do you wish of me? How may I serve you? It's raiding, mid range, line of sight. That could be pretty good. Also, I should go to war with them. How can I be of assistance? Ready for battle. Actually, placing them there to be attacked while on patrol is not a good idea. Then again, I think they uh, they can just about get attacked there as well. Uh, let's place him there. What do you wish we hunger for battle. Actual mercenary replenishment. That might be actually pretty good at this point. Mercenaries are always good. Yeah, we still don't get that much money off of them. 
Actually, that's a thousand more. Look at that. Yeah. It's only like my uh, one less public order, so let's do that. How can I serve Rome? Ready for orders. At once. Gathering supplies. Your orders. I'm not sure if these guys are going to be good versus their navy. We'll see. The problem is that Admiral, Admiral is my guy. Come on, guys, get them to like me. He's on a mission. We go get the Spartans to like us as well. And the Dalmatii. Maybe I should have checked how many turns is the agent going to be out. Oh, well, he hello there. Look at that. Two armies out of nowhere. I would have been screwed if I went for it. The question is, do I make just four top and let them attack me? Or what do exactly do I do? We'll see. Because like making a four, the enemy is gonna be stupid enough to just attack one, one way. Unless they got uh, two armies attacking us, they're gonna come at us from two sides probably. On where where the reinforcements come in. Why not they do all the income from trading? Yeah, that's what we do. Technology research penalty. Okay, do we get the imperial units then? Uh, apparently not. Might actually need the barracks. Would have thought. So let me check. No, yeah, no changes there. Let me see what can we do. Actually, like, where's the next upgrade here? Yeah, oh, shit. That's gonna take a while. We hunger for battle. Now we'll see. Do we have a chance to actually? Or let's see. Where the where's the spy? If she's here, let's move her down here to be so we can see what's happening. That's an enemy fleet. They can get to our fleet and get to them as well. Let me actually check. Okay. Let me see. Oh, <laughs> well, shit. Yeah, they're gonna they're gonna wreck him now. Let's just disband all of them. Military wars are gonna be done next turn as well. Good. Ready for orders. Hmm. At your command. 
Yeah, it's the ambush five. What about here? Forty. Five. Ready for orders. Yeah, this. Yeah, there's actually forty there. Concealed from you. Ready for battle. What about here? Five. We're fucking funny if we actually manage to ambush him here. On the move for battle. Get to it, men. Ready for orders. To it, man. Let's see what happens. These guys should ambush them as they come in to attack these if they do. What do you wish of me? Got nothing to build. Except maybe eh, we can actually can we get another army? Mm. Nope. Military wars are gonna be done next. I'm gonna need a decent fleet to attack these down the here. That's gonna be a, a must. See if the AI is dumb enough to attack. No, they ran away. Okay, the AI is dumb enough to attack. We're moving pretty freaking close. I think they're actually in range of the settlement garrison as well. There. <laughs> That's funny. You, where is he? Let's see. Yeah, you just show up there again. 